<laughs> thank you, thank you, Tim. And we love you too. We love you, Tim. And, uh, and thank you, HRC, for this tremendous honor. Wow, it wasn't until we watched that clip reel that I realized how gay our show is. Our show is, our show is totally gay. It's so gay. It's so gay. Oh, how, how gay is it? Our show's so gay, we have our own parade. Our show is so gay, it works out twice a day. Our show is so gay, it's like Brokeback Mountain making out with Boys Don't Cry. Our show is so gay, we make Richard Simmons look straight. <laughs> Our show is so gay, it keeps redecorating. <laughs> Our show is so gay, Rosie's Cruz bashed us. <laughs> Our show is so gay, it takes its shirt off and dances all night long. <laughs> our show is so gay, Senator Craig hangs out in our bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <nice. laughs> um, we also send greetings and thanks from the series producers Silvio Horta, Salma Hayek, Ben Silverman, and Marco Panette, and from our dream cast of talented colleagues. They're all honored with your kind acknowledgments of our ugly little show. What's going on? What? What? It, Senator Craig? <laughs> Is that you? <laughs> we are so fortunate to be a part of a show that not only means so much to its viewers, but to us as actors. The most satisfying aspect of playing Mark is that he is, as are all the characters, gay, straight, or transgendered, on an equal playing field. Mark is no more conniving than Wilhelmina or Amanda, and Alexis faces the same parental rejection that her brother Daniel faces. For once, a show with gay sensibilities actually makes sense. <laughs> the gay and transgendered characters aren't simply comic relief or cast as the villains. They have full equality in their ability to be evil or good. So the point is that Ugly Betty is telling people that our common traits count more than our differences, and it's okay to be whoever you want to be. Whether it's Mark coming out to his mother or Betty trying to find a place in a world where she so desperately wants to belong, Ugly Betty strikes a chord with viewers everywhere. But it's also a show that means a lot to each of us personally. Having several friends who are transgendered, I thought the character of Alexis would be a fun challenge and that my friends and my friends counseled me and helped me and understand the issues that they faced. Even with their support, I wasn't prepared for the effect it had on me. I feel like I'm part of a movement of people who are just starting to make it into the mainstream society and Alexis is adding to the national dialogue. She seems so much more important than just a character. I'm very proud to be a part of Ugly Betty and thankful to the brave transgendered men and women who are dealing with these issues every day. Thank you. I thank you for your courage, and I hope that Ugly Betty will continue to portray your struggle with heart. Our show is so gay that everybody should just get, get used to it! it. <laughs> Thank you.